Hey guys, this Diggy Man here, and I'm here to show you how to install Millionaire 1.2.3. Now, there's two ways to do it. You're gonna be using, you can use it as a forge, or you don't have to use a forge. But we're gonna prepare this Minecraft jar for both, just in case you want to use. Um, Something like better than wolves in it and stuff like that. Better than wolves mod for farming and stuff like that. But um, other than that, it will work. Okay, first thing we want to do is download the my the millionaire mod 2.4.5. That's the newest version for 1.3.3, 1.2.3 Minecraft and you need the mod loader for 1.2.3 I'm gonna leave the links underneath <clears throat> you go there now and install them onto your desktop like so okay so let's do this we're going to start we're gonna go down here you're gonna press percentage app data percentage like so go up to roaming go to dot minecraft and you're gonna have a little file in here you're gonna X out of this right now for now you're gonna have a little file in here it's gonna say bin resources save file stats texture pack logon last logon options okay you're gonna come to bin and you're gonna left click it twice and this screen is gonna pop up it's gonna have you're gonna come down to minecraft jar right click it once and with this you're gonna have to open it with winrar or 7-zip okay you're gonna have to download that from the internet too winrar is a program that opens these jars up for you so you could install mods and so on and so forth so I use Winmar so let's press that and there goes your jar your jar pops up and it's open so we're gonna X out of this so now we're gonna have your bin files up here and your Minecraft jar down here so now we're gonna go down to your millionaire mod right over here you're gonna right click it once go up and open with WinRAR same program and this should pop up here like so Ooh, where'd it go oh it's over here okay so you, this is your Minecraft over here and this is your mod you're gonna open it up now you're gonna see a bunch of files in here now this is what I was saying you got your forge extender pack right here the source file so you're gonna pop that open and highlight the SRR source file and you're gonna left click it hold it down and bring it right under here up under your bin here and let go so that goes here now you're gonna back this up see this little thing back it up now you're gonna come to put in your Minecraft folder. You're gonna open it up. You're gonna see this in here, Millionaire and Millionaire Custom. Now you're gonna left click the bottom here and highlight them all here. And hold down your left mouse button and bring it over under here. Not over the files, under here. And let go. Now both of them just jumped in there. Now let's back it up again come down to put in your minecraft jar if forge is absent <clears throat> now we're not using forge so we're going to use this i'm going to pop this open and highlight all these left click it hold it down and bring it over here over your class files not over your folders here over your class files and let go say okay gonna back up again you're gonna come to put in mods folder we're not gonna use it as a mod folder you're gonna click it once and you're gonna 
see is a zip file that looks exactly like this one. Left click it twice. And then you're going to have a big fo file folder of classes in here. Now you're going to highlight one of them, right click it, and select all. And all these files should be highlighted now. Now with your left click, you're going to hold it down and drag it right into your class files, over your class files, not over your folders here. Over your class files and let go. Boom. Good? Good. Alright, now we're done. We could X out of the millionaire. And that's pretty much done now. Don't forget, first thing you have to do after you do that, come down and there's a file called Meta Inf. You're going to highlight it once, right click it, and come up to your delete files. You don't need this in your Minecraft when you're modding. Every time you're modding, you should delete this file. Unless you're doing a server mod, but that's totally different. We're not talking about that. We're talking about client single player mod. So we're going to delete this file. Say delete. Say yes. And that's gone out of our life. Get out of my life. Now, we need our mod loader folder here. So you're going to right click it, open with WinRAR, 7-zip, doesn't matter. You're going to right click it there, and this pops up. You're going to highlight all these classes, left click it once, and drag it over your class files. Make sure you drag them over your class files, not over here, because if they jump in here, it could damage the Minecraft jar in here. So just bring them over here. Where it's safe around here somewhere and let go and that should be it now your mod is in there you want to run it want to check it out want to see if it's working let's let's work it out start up your minecraft like so hmm uh oh uh oh uh oh I think it's working. Uh, we'll create a new world. Let's create it. Oh, it's building. It's building. Oh, there you go. Looks like it's saving chunks. No. Well, right here in the bottom here, you're going to see located. You could press V to locate the nearest village. There's nothing around me. Fly up, take a peek around. On the little island, we're at the little, look at this beach, beautiful beach. We're gonna fly over here, Let's see if we can find some kind of village. As soon as you're walking around, it will alert you when you got a village around. So it will suddenly bloop, say, hey, there's a village northeast or northwest. And you can interact with these guys, and uh, it's a great mod. I like it when I'm playing single player, when Spikey's not around or stuff, and I'm on a freaking island. I don't think we're gonna find a village here. <laughs> Good little island, too. Look at this little tropical island. Oh, well, maybe it's not an island. Let's continue looking this way. We never know. Oh, well, 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 we got a snow biome here. Yet, I see sheep. Hey, sheep, have you seen some? Oh, Japanese village. Oh, this is new. This is a new village for 1.2.3. Oh, look at this. These are Japanese people. Oh, wow, look at him making his own little farm over here. That is Cool. He's probably making some kind of a uh, rice patty because that's in Asia. They have a lot of uh, rice patties because in the watery lands. But this is not really a swampy land. But he's making his own little thing. I don't know. Maybe it's something else. But look at this. Saki. 
they sell sake and do they have sushi? No, please. Oh, look at this. I wouldn't mess with these people because there could be samurais here or um, see they'll say hi. And over here, there's uh, what they need. They need eight stone. Hotch, whatever that is. So, oh, little kids. And I guess they're make. Look at these sheep. They're really eating this place up. These sheep are starving. All right, there you go, guys. Um, well, they're growing. Look at these guys. They're growing out here. It's really cool. Um, it's a great addition if you're playing first player. Single player, I mean. Ooh, what is that? There's a cave down here. Alright, man. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what my next spotlight is. I want to show you every mod you guys want. Give me a like, give me a comment, and I hope it works out for you. This is one for 1.2.3 Minecraft. Um, I'll leave the links underneath, and good luck guys, Diggy Man out.